Hello YouTube and in today's video I wanted to show you how you can add a font to the game uh, and then assign it to the team that you want so in this video I will show an example of adding Barcelona's Champions League font and then assigning it to them because uh, as you know Barcelona doesn't have a deal with the EA but with PES so they miss out on a lot of face scans and they don't have a stadium so a font is also something that they don't have like Real or Atletico Madrid have uh, both the La Liga font and the, the European competitions so let's dive into it the first step for you is obviously to have the font files themselves right so for example, I managed to find uh, the TTF online for Barcelona's uh, font. It's from two seasons ago, but it's still the same font, uh, so it's it's fine. And then, once you have that, you can install it, and in Photoshop, you can just type numbers out. Uh, because numbers have to be from 0 to 9 in the PNG uh, as you can see 256 by 512 with uh, obviously uh, transparent background and uh, they don't have to be red but since EA is uh, using red uh, just uh, make them red and that's the color that it picks the best if you are uh, putting uh, the font that has two values on it so for example Premier League uh, numbers have uh, in the number in the bottom they have like the lion Premier League logo so that other things they should be for example green something completely opposite so the game can register that they, there are two colors in that font and color them accordingly um, if you don't have the TTF you will have to make it so you'll have to find for example a picture like this this is very low quality so if you can't find a higher quality it will be <laughs> a little bit difficult you will have to do a lot of uh, fixing up in the Photoshop and uh, what you can do is basically highlight the area copy the layers I'm not gonna show that in th that would be too long in Photoshop and then uh, also for the letters and there are websites that then can turn your uh, pictures like these PNG files into the TTF file uh, you just assign assign every symbol uh, specifically but let's let's say that you do have TTF already the easier step and you type these nine already out you save them each as PNG the next step is for you to go into the FIFA editor tool and as you can see I already opened my project so you need to go into Jersey fonts and this is for the name and kit number the, these are obviously for numbers and you need to choose since you cannot add anything you need to choose uh, another font and replace it so I chose China's Super League font so here you just go right click so let me show you how this looks unmodified uh, you have these three files ignore these blueprints and you just go here and import and you choose your uh, TTF file and then in number it's pretty straightforward uh, you will have nine numbers like this and you just import the your PNGs for each of those numbers you export the mode right here 
and fill it out like you see fit you can in this description put these IDs this will be important because uh, these IDs are then used for your assignment of the fonts so we are done with the fit mode part now we have to add the competitions table to the team to the desired team so we open our career file like this down here career files and choose your career if you played your career last it will be last one modified so it's easy for you to identify but uh, if you are not sure just open it and right here in an, in a second once all this loads it will show you what's the name of that particular career so you can be sure that you are uh, editing the right one and also it should go without mentioning but uh, always make sure that m to make backups of your career files every time you make changes so right now it opened <coughs> we go to db2 and we find competition kits so it's right here competition kits and we need to add values so easiest way to do easiest uh, way to go about this is to find for example for me barcelona is in spain so i want to add uh, all the competitions that Spanish team would uh, find themselves in and use that additional font so I could uh, find for example as I mentioned Real and Atletico they have the the font so you go all the way right and then click in this column team tech ID and find for example Atletico is 240 hit enter and as you can see let me full screen this so 243 is already real madrid so it has one two three it has 20 values so let's see let's uh, highlight the row like this that's the first row so it has 223, 224, 226, 232, and 2096. So let's see what all those are. I'll link this IDs table so that you can check it out yourself. You go here on competitions and let's see 223 is Champions League, 224 Europa League, Conference League, and what it was 32. Let's super cup and 296 it's not in the table so i don't know what uh, that might be but it could be it could be spanish cup it just isn't uh, is in isn't in this table but that doesn't matter you copy it anyways so as you can see it has five different competitions and then obviously for four different kids so um, that that is actually shown all the way right here so team tech per id five zeros so five competitions for home five times the away five times the two is goalkeeper five times three I have fourth kit added so I need to make 25 of those entries so this is a bit of a legwork and I'm not gonna show you everything but it's pretty straightforward you copy first value click copy record and then go all the way on the bottom of the table and you paste it and then do it obviously for uh, all five competitions and then you can just copy them from here as many as you need so as you can see I have one batch, two batch, three batch, four, five so 
for kids and goalkeeper kit and make sure that uh, on your added kit so I added four these obviously have to be team tech per ID they need to be four if you add a third they would be three etc um, all these values here those are the color values you can edit them either here or easier method is just to power up G table and uh, change the colors there so what is uh, important you can also edit this and I will show you how it looks uh, when you open the the G table so you can edit those in G table too but you can edit them in here uh, first so you have jersey name font type so that's the ID and obviously you need to put this whatever you changed uh, whatever you assigned so my font is as I said description name font is 103 and number is 107 170 so 103 for this column jersey name font type and then these are all the colors of the jersey until you get to this column number font type so this ID is as I said 170 for me so you can edit those here or you can edit them uh, in the cheat table and as I said those are for the assignment so that your mod is assigned to that team and once you are then done with this table so uh, as I uh, to recap you need to copy each of those instances so just check out the ID table and add whatever you could add uh, more competitions here it doesn't matter but uh, for me I play realistic so these are only the European competitions as I said Champions League, Europa League, Conference League and Sup uh, Super Cup you go ahead and save it and you are done only thing left for you is to power up your game and uh, check out your work and if you didn't change the colors in the RDBN table or you didn't assign the font there then you could you can do that with cheat table and I will show you right now how how that looks so load your save and conveniently I put myself in Champions League match so let's power up the the cheat table so cheat table is right here you need cheat engine by the way for the cheat table I will link it in the description as well or you could do this with live editor it doesn't matter live editor is standalone but some people prefer the good old cheat table me included you go in the teams editor and the first time it will just show you the first ID so Arsenal you can find your team here or you can go back into game and let it refresh but I will type my ID Barcelona's ID is 2 for 1 find and here it is you go to kids table and as you can see these are the kids we have so home away goalkeeper third and unknown kit it says four so that's the fourth kit because it says unknown because we added it and then as you can see for each of these competitions as I said so there is 25 more values because five values for five kits so you go here and you go to Jersey 
and you see here there's a name font type so we already changed it in RDBM and this number font time but you can do, do it here and obviously change the colors and it's a bit of a legwork but you need to do it for each of these according to your so you need to copy right so on kit for me it has to be white font so it's white on this one on this for each home kit and then away copy colors of each away and you get the point so that's that let's see how it looks in game And already here you could uh, have a glimpse of it, but I will go into replay and, and show you more closely. and as you can see the end product so we were successful and i hope that uh, this tutorial was useful to you as well and if you have any additional questions as always either comment them uh, down below on in the youtube or even better method for me to get back to you is to contact me on discord so i will link the discord server and uh, in the description and if you have any questions as i said do not hesitate that's the, that's all for this video and see you in the next one